Today we will be talking about dopamine inclusion. As we know that we have three kind of doses for different purposes. Uh, we have a low renal dopamine dose which is 2.5 to uh, 5 microgram per kg per minute. We have an intermediate cardiac which is also known as a cardiac dose which is 5 to 15 microgram per uh, kg per minute. And we have a high dose which we usually uh, give in uh, certain shock lock condition in greater than 20 microgram per kg per minute. So to let's have an example, uh, we have a patient, uh, 10 kilogram uh, weight, uh, the patient is weighing 10 kg, let's say, and we have to start this patient on a 10 microgram per kg per minute dose. Now, as we know that the patient weight is 10 and the dose is 10 microgram per kg per minute. So you know, uh, if we multiply these two, uh, we will get 100 microgram per minute. So we have to give this patient 100 microgram and uh, usually in the syringe pumps and the infusion pumps the setting is the delivery rate is uh, somewhere uh, set in hour so uh, 100 microgram per minute so to convert it into per hour we will uh, just multiply it by 60 so this will become 6000 microgram per hour so our target will be to deliver the patient 6000 microgram per, per hour now we also have this uh, that usually the injection dopamine chem comes in uh, in fuel uh, which contains 40 milligram per ml. So to avoid the confusion of microgram, the difference in the unit, we divide the 6000 by 1000 to convert it into the microgram into milligram. So this is shown here. So we will have to give this patient 6 milligram per hour. Now let's come to uh, the target so the target is 600 6 milligram uh, milligram of dopamine uh, per hour we have to deliver it to the patient normally we we cannot give 6 milligram uh, in a in, in a duration of one hour until and unless we dissolve it in some vehicle solution and for instance that vehicle solution is normal saline in the case now as we know that one ml of dopamine contains 40 milligrams so if we fo dissolve 40 milligram are 1 ml of normal uh, dopamine in 49 ml of normal sign that will become a 50 ml solution so we can say that if as 1 ml is equal to 40 milligram and if we so the total amount of the uh, dopamine in this solution will be 50 in this in total solution uh, 50 cc is 40 milligram but our target is to deliver only 6 milligram now we have to find out that if the solution of 50 cc contain 40 milligram so how much uh, uh, of that solution how see how much a milliliter of that solution will contain actually 60 grams using the mathematical principle of cross multiplication we get to know that that it is actually uh, 7.5 ml of this solution contains 6 milligram so if we set the rate on the infusion pump at 7.5 ml per hour it will deliver 6 milligram per hour or we can also say it will deliver 10 microgram per kg per minute so that's it